Vikings rookie defensive tackle Jalen Twyman is expected to make a full recovery after being shot four times, Twyman's agent Drew Rosenhaus told ESPN's Adam Schefter. The Vikings have been apprised of the situation. Twyman's gunshot wounds were described by Rosenhaus as superficial exit wounds that were sustained inside a vehicle while visiting his aunt in Washington, D.C. He had negative X-rays and will not need surgery. Twyman was simply at the wrong place, wrong time, Rosenhaus told Schefter. In talking to him today, he's going to be okay, that's all that matters, Rosenhaus said, via Schefter. We're thankful he's okay. He will make a full recovery. The 6'2", 301-pound Twyman was a sixth-round pick in this year's draft. Before opting out of the 2020 season, Twyman enjoyed a breakout year with the Pitt Panthers. Wearing no. 97 in honor of former Pitt and current NFL standout Aaron Donald, Twyman recorded 10. 5 sacks and 12 tackles for loss in 2019. He had at least a half sack in eight games that season that included three sacks against Ohio and two. Five sacks against North Carolina. Twyman likely sealed his draft fate after benching 225 pounds a whopping 40 times during Pitt's pro day. Twyman is part of a Vikings rookie class that includes fellow Panther Patrick Jones too, a defensive end who tallied 17. Five sacks during his last two years in Pittsburgh. The duo will look to help improve a Vikings defense that finished 29th in scoring, 25th in passing, 27th in rushing, 10th in third down efficiency and 11th in red zone efficiency last season. It's something that I was hoping and praying for when I was getting interviewed by the Vikings and I knew we were two potential prospects, Twyman said of possibly playing with Jones at the next level. I've just been keeping my fingers crossed that I'd be able to reunite with one of my brothers, whether that was Rashad Weaver or Patrick Jones. It's a blessing to be able to chase quarterbacks down again with Patrick.